<clears throat> you know one, the U.S. geography, the regions of the U.S. The United States can be divided into five regions. Those regions are in the northeast,、uh, the southeast, the midwest, the southwest, and the northwest. Let's talk about the north. East first. The northeast has eleven states.、Uh, it inc- it has states such as New York City,、mm, Washington D.C.,、uh, Philadelphia,、mm, and and well, there's more, <clears throat> but there's more to it. That's where the pilgrims, along the first explorers to sail to America, founded. And Puritans too. Since the, since your city is really crowded, it might every part of the northeast part is kind of like、um, urban area.、Um, when I mean urban,、uh, lots of buildings and lots of people and lots of people meet each other. Some restaurants and stuff. Whatever what I'm talking about. Am I just cool here or am I just weird? <laughs> Now let's talk about the southeast state. The southeast. Has one more state, one more state than the northeast state. Well, it well just add one to eleven. That's twelve. So it has twelve states. It has states including Georgia, Florida, and the Mississippi. The and there's the greatest landmark like Mississippi River right there. And also the best way to get food is to get cash crops, like cotton, soybeans, um.、Uh, Uh, weed stuff and stuff, whatever you talk about. Mid <laughs> the Midwest is also called the broad the breadbasket of the United States, which you can say U.S. includes states like Minnesota, Iowa, Michigan, Kansas, and has plains and prairies, which are good for planting. So that's why they call it the breadbasket of the U- U.S. Now let's talk about the Southwest. The Southwest it has states including、uh, Arizona, New Mexico, not Mexico, New Mexico,、uh, Oklahoma, Oklahoma. That's all to it. And it has the greatest history of it, the Grand Canyon. There's another Grand Canyon on Mars, but it's way not bigger. Grand Can the Grand Canyon is smaller than the Grand Canyon on Mars, whatever it is. Tattoos is a type of type of well landform, and also is a desert. Well, they're part of the landforms actually, and diverse. Well, it's kind of like they're diverse. You know what I mean. Northwest, it has it has some states as Oregon, Washington, not Washington D.C., Washington. Nevada, Utah, California, and lots of stuff, and it has landforms such as Rocky Mountains. Now, here's a really cool thing to remember: where these, where these things are, are and also located. Well, at this that I used for some help, I drew a little map right here. I drew a little map. And there are also places the Midwest. Well, it doesn't touch any any oceans. Let's say, well, the best way is to remember which one is touching the ocean. Let's say, the Midwest is not touching any ocean except some a few lakes. I forgot to draw them there. Um, the northeast and the southeast is is on the right side of the map. So it's kind of, um. <laughs> Touching the Pacific, the Atlantic Ocean. Well,、uh, well, the ocean in the middle of the Earth, right here. The Northwest and Southwest is is touching the Pacific Ocean. Um, right here, the largest ocean, the first largest ocean in the world. Kind of cool, huh?、Mm-hmm. <clears throat> And it's really cool that they unite. And also, here's a tip. And also, I forgot to tell you something. This is Alaska. 
but it's separate from the United States. It's way above. Well, actually, it's somewhere near the land of Canada, um, left side of Canada, top part, and it's part of the U.S. A thin kind of sliver connects to it, only you can't see it on maps. And this little islands, there are actually much more islands than just four, uh, make Hawaii. And one of the islands are called Hawaii. Hawaii. Really crazy, huh? Well, you can get these, but well, by just drawing it. But it's just a formal map by uh, just dotted lines. <laughs> so I hope you will see me next time, and I'll see you next time. This is U.S. This is the U.S. Geography. Sitting for U.S. Geography is Shen Han.